then also after class, it is important to follow up with the interaction or the engagement that you've established already in the class, knowing fully where that engagement doesn't end in the class. So how do you as a TA or as an instructor follow up on the interactions that have been built in the class and then taking that after class so that the next class or the subsequent class that you're having or the subsequent lab you're having, you can get better engagement. So using traditional emails, sending emails to the student after the class, telling them how wonderful they did, finishing their experiment on time, highlighting the things that you want them to concentrate on when they're writing their reports. This means of communication is important. Also making them know that they can always send you an email, letting them know that as your TA, as your instructor, I'm that first point of contact for you. I'm just an email away. When you have anything, just shoot me an email. We can figure it out together. Building and fostering that kind of interaction somehow just helps the student feel a lot more comfortable. They begin to see you as a better and reliable resource. And that way, when they get back into the class, they feel more comfortable to open up and let you know, I still don't understand this thing. I need help with this thing. Or like seeing that almighty TA who is just grading their work and helping them lose points. They begin to see someone that they can interact with and that can help promote engagement. Holding efficient office hours is also important. And I say efficient office hours is because the timing of the office hour, making sure that the student get the best experience from the office hour is very important. And being a reliable resource to the student can also help to improve engagement even after the class letting the student know that we can always figure out the problem. It might not also be the laboratory course, it could even be the theoretical chemistry class that you're having issues with. Let's come together, let's figure it out, let's walk through the problem together. Having your student have that trust in you and knowing that you're really there to help them would help to improve the class experience and will help to engage the class. Because you have different types of students. Some students are more open to asking questions in class, some would prefer one-on-one, -on -one, you know, talking to you via emails. You just have to reach everyone one way or the other. You have to adapt and have one niece or the other that can help to meet the different personalities of the students so that everyone has an avenue to be able to interact with the course, interact with the TA and get the best from the class.